Hello, there we go. Now there's sound. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Astro Games Day 98, the day where we play City Skylines. Uh, basically, the idea came from um, me streaming City Skylines on a special where I just wanted to relax, and it turned out to be a really, really fun stream. Uh, People really seem to enjoy watching me build a parking lot slash garbage dump. So that's what we're going to do today. Um, again, on Astral Games, so I can uh, put it on YouTube for all to see. Uh, that was basically the idea behind this. Uh, before we do that though, hey Angoril, what's up man? Welcome. Also, oh also, uh, not only are we building a garbage dump, we're also building a garbage dump on a map made by uh, Lao1187, a streamer who usually streams these kinds of games, city builders, simulation games, uh, that sort of stuff. Really cool, and um, yeah, it's really awesome to, uh, it's really an honor to uh, turn her map into a parking lot garbage dump. So, um, announcements as always before we start the stream. How are you doing, Angriel, by the way? Uh, glad to see you here. Chilling out here after uh, Warwitch this morning gave us a uh, ba big awakening. I think you were there as well. Um, yeah, it was, uh, was a great stream as always. That guy is a amazing streamer. Um, so this is the only Astral Games for this week, but it's not the only stream. Um, I have two more streams planned this week, Saturday and Sunday. So in the weekend I will be streaming, or at least Saturday is planned for sure. Sunday I still have to ask, but um, I'm assuming he, he will say yes and will be streaming. So this is the Astral Games day for this week because other days I have work. Um, I have a conference call with Finland tomorrow, which is really amazing. Let's see if I can do some work for them. Um, the University of Helsinki. Uh, it's really cool. And um, yeah, doing good trying to sort the files on the PC. I, I'm doing great, Angrel. I'm really looking forward to this week. I have a lot of work to do and I love my job, so I'm really looking forward to this week. Um, and I'm also really looking forward to the stream. Let's hope that this city will not turn into the garbage dump that it That the previous one was Nor the one with a lot of traffic problems and a Bermuda road where trucks seem to disappear into nowhere, which is really uh, Was a really interesting thing in my city um, So uh, that's this week uh, for Astro Games Day, and on the weekend, on Saturday, I will have a stream with Philip Rich, Binary Ferret, and Toby Maguire. We'll be conti finally continuing our adventures in the Greece, uh, well, in the Titan Quest, I should say. We have arrived in Act 2, which is no longer Greece, but it is Egypt, so uh, we'll be slaying some Egyptian-themed monsters uh, on Saturday. And continuing our quest uh, in the world of Titan Quest. I tried to make up a very smart comment there, but unfortunately I failed. Um, <laughs> trying to sort files on the PC, that's very important as well to do, for sure. Make sure the PC is all tidied up and everything. I'm really bad at that, by the way, but um, yeah. Um, so that's on Saturday, and on Sunday, if I can uh, figure it out, if he wants to uh, join me, but I think he'll say yes, so I'm going to safely say that on Sunday I probably have a Borderlands 2 stream uh, together with Jagalama, a good friend of mine who I met through, and there he is. <laughs> Welcome Jagalama, we were just talking about you, I was just about to say that this week I'm going to ask you if you have time on the usual Sunday evening well Sunday middle of the day for you for us to do uh, Borderlands 2 this week um, at least um, yeah so if he will say yes then uh, 
then we'll have that on Sunday. I'm doing great, Jago. I'm doing really great. I hope you're doing fine as well. It's not the usual type of sorting. More the remaining... Renaming thousands of files. Oh, crap. Renaming a thousand files. I'll make sure my files are the right name uh, <laughs> when I get them on the PC. I don't, I don't want to spend time renaming a thousand files. That would drive me crazy. Um, but yeah, so three streams if everything uh, goes along and people uh, go along as well. And then we're on to next week where I don't know. I have no idea. I do this week by week. Um, also because like this Saturday was a amazing day. We had a um, uh, information market. So basically people with uh, different companies or initiatives uh, with autism um, were present. And people from the, from the area came and talked to us. And I talked to some really interesting people uh, with organizations or individuals who were looking for uh, coaches uh, and stuff like that, you know, guidance counselors, whatever. So if everything goes through there, I might have to stream. Well, the stream might be, yeah. I, I mean, I'm, I'm sure I'll make time to stream as well. Of course, obviously, I love it. I love it too much. Uh, but it's it's gonna be busy if everything goes through the way it's um, you know proposed at this point. Um, obviously, uh, they all have to talk to their superiors and stuff like that. So it's gonna take a while. But if everything goes uh, along as it is now, then it's gonna be busy for my company. Uh, so that's great. But I'll make sure to uh, leave some time for uh, for some streaming as well. So, we talked about this week. Um, in the future, before we move on to the game, in the future, um, <clears throat> I'm talking now in astral, terms of Astral Games Days. Uh, you'll notice that this is Astral Games Day 98, if you do read the title. Not everyone does that, but if you have read the title or are reading the title, you'll notice that this is Astral Games Day 98. As for Games Day 99, will be Dark Souls 2. We'll be continuing... Uh, no, Dark Souls 1, sorry. Dark Souls 1. Uh, we'll be continuing my very first playthrough of Dark Souls. Um, and we're going to try and kill the Taurus Demon in Astro Games Day 99. Hopefully, I can get that done within the four hours that Astro Games Days take. So, there we go. Um... That's on the horizon for 99. And then on Astro Games Day 100, which is the final day that I've planned forward, is Pillars of Eternity. Many thanks to WolfCup71 who donated me the game. Why, I don't know, but it's very, very kind. And that gesture has not gone unnoticed. But WolfCup71 has made sure that you guys get to see uh, Pillars of Eternity on Astro Games Day 100. So that's going to be, um, you know, a mini celebration of sorts, hitting 100 episodes with my uh, official show. Um, I do have astral specials and stuff like that. If you do count those along, uh, I'm sure that uh, we've already reached over 100 because I already have a 24 hour special and a 16 hour special. And then I haven't even talked about all the D&D episodes and stuff like that. So. I've appeared on Twitch over 100 episodes, but uh, for the official show, that will be the uh, celebration, sort of mini celebration. So, we talked about the future, let's head into the present with City Skylines. Um, really curious to see what this map has to offer. I have not yet seen it. This is it. Well, I've seen this screenshot, but this screenshot doesn't tell you a lot. So... Um, it's based on a uh, on a place in England or Scotland, I believe. Um, her boyfriend is Scottish, so I'm sure that's not too far away uh, from maybe where he lives or anything. I don't know. Um, but yeah, she said that this was the uh, map she hadn't tested yet, so... 
we're gonna test it for her. Make sure everything works as intended. If we can build a garbage dump slash parking lot on this map, then it works as intended. <laughs> Let's put it at that. Um, if, it, if I can't build a city on your map, then your map is really bad. Because, um, you know, my cities are... Well, my cities go bad really easily. Okay, so this is the controls. I'm re-familiarizing myself because it's been a while since I played this game, to be fair. Uh, I did play it a bit outside of the stream, but not by much. Okay, they're giving us the land where there's exactly the river thing. Huh. Okay, so we need to make a strategy here. We need to strategize. Um, let's see. There was a re- nope. Nope. Oh wait, I forgot to name the city. Hold on. Let's quit, let's quit. For a sec. I need to name the city, of course. <clears throat> Angel Sky. Anglesey, I mean. Anglesey. I think I mis- mistwittered it. Uh, let's go with Profitville. I want you guys to, I want this to be your city because, you know, I like placing you guys in dysfunctional garbage dumps. Um, all right. Oh, now it's all, all of a sudden there's a mist. Okay. Let's see. Uh, there was a resource map somewhere. I just can't remember where. I know I need to build roads. Game. Here it is. Oh, we can't see it yet. Okay. So we can't see where the industry needs to be. However. Hello, this is Chirper. Hello, Chirper. Welcome. Welcome. Alright. Hmm. I'm pondering where to build the industry and where to build the housing. Like making a bridge. And then maybe building the housing along this way. Or we could... Because this is beach property right here. I mean, look at this. This could be beach property right here. So making housing on this side and industry on this side is the would be optimal. However, that means building a bridge and bridges are expensive. Let's see if we can. Let's see if we if the game allows us to build a bridge while still being, you know, financially viable. Okay, there's a small bridge. Ooh, this does uh, this does remind me of the uh, Cedar Point bridge that we uh, had to cross every time we went to the park. Amazing park, by the way. All right, so we've got sixty thousand left. So if we build a road here. So, and then like, so, we can build power plants and all that good stuff, industry right there. Oh, looks like he's running away from something. See this leg and then that leg. Ah, run away. <laughs> run away from the city. Might be a viable tactic. Okay. So if we just draw this road here. Just keep on drawing. Keep on drawing. Not too expensive, please. There we go. And then we just start zoning stuff. Hey, Demon Eye, what's up? Welcome. How are you doing? All right. We need water as well. So we're going to pump water.
What if we... Oh, the border doesn't... Uh, uh, the border doesn't give me water here. That sucks. So if we dump trash in this river and pump it out of here. No, because we can't access this. Damn it. Why can't we access two bodies of water? That sucks. We don't know where the stream goes, right? I'm doing great, Demon Eye. I'm doing great. Okay, so the stream goes like this. Like this. So we need sewage first and then pumps. Yeah, right. Okay. Oh, I'm so careful with my money. What's that? Oh, it's a small tree. Look at that. Tree on the hill. But yeah, I'm doing great. Really looking forward to uh, to this week. Oh, hey, arrows. That's neat. So we just built like a basin thing. Like so. And then we build like a power plant with all this pollution and stuff. Like here. And then we build like residents who live, you know, in Bridge County or something. So the residents start there. And then we take the pipelines. Two thousand. Yep, I can still pay for that. Cool. There we go. Pipelines through the water. And of course. Space already occupied. Wait, can we... Can we put this across water? Oh, cool. Yes. Excellent. Then they have electricity, they have water, we still have money. It looks rubbish, but we should be good. Man, that's cool. They just build it over water like that. And then all we do is we just put some people there. And some industry here, because, you know, there's industry. There's pollution anyway. And then we should be good to go. I think this is the first city I'm going to start without a deficit. I have a good feeling about this. Juiced. Okay, now just buildings need to appear. My singing lessons are going good, man. Oh, they still, they also need power? Fine. My singing lessons are going great. As a matter of fact, I have more today, so... It's going to be interesting. <laughs> you should sing the longer song for us. I might in the future, who knows. go still 14k left yeah oh yeah and here come the buildings yes excellent no deficit so far 
Sewage? I can't help sewage yet. I probably need more... Uh, more people. Sewage and power is the problem. I know. What if I... Do this. Hey, Philip. Thanks for the, uh, thanks for the host, man. Toads with hypnotic abilities are the most popular pet. You could imagine why. Uh oh, no, we're going into a deficit, guys. I was hoping to avoid that. Crap. But no. Apparently we are in deficit, Phil. How can we help the power situation? Whew. Okay. Oh man, we're going into deficit fill again. Damn it. Even with the cheapest roads. Even with the cheapest roads. I don't know how to do that. I, I just don't know how people do it. How do people do it? This seems like a really simple city. Like there's nothing expensive about this city. And yet I'm going into a deficit. <laughs> hey Sky, this, this is a uh, poo city indeed. Yep, I'm I'm probably a, I'm probably would be a good UK or Dutch minister because for some reason I go into a deficit all the freaking time. This seems like a simple city. I mean, what are they paying for? The power plant and the water pump. That's what they're paying for. And we're already minus a thousand. Oh, is it the power plant thing? Oh, okay. Yeah. Then we're in a deficit because of the power plant thing. Did I go too, uh, too powerful on the power? <laughs> Damn. I just can't for some reason make a city that's, uh, you know, not going in deficit the first time. There you go. Have some industrial zone. The toilet is not working. Yeah, I know. I can't sewage yet, guys. Oh, wait, I can, right? I can. Shit. I should have. I should have sewaged. Oh, well. I usually stick a turbine to my water and sewage pumps and then another to the actual house and buildings. Yeah, that, that might have been the better tactic. 
I'm still not good at this game apparently. <laughs> but then again, I haven't played since the last I streamed, so. <clears throat> yeah, experience the poo, guys. Experience the poo. Oh, I'm going in a deficit. Crap. I don't need info windows, I need money. Ah. Fine, fine. I'll build the entirety of the industrial zone. There you go. That is the entirety of the industrial zone. You guys have fun. Oh, and now he's low on fuel as well. Oh boy, yeah. Windmills might be the best idea, I'm sure. Sure that I screwed up now. I will not start over. I will go bankrupt, I will gain bankruptcy money, and then I will be able to build sewage. And then people will start moving in again. It's just the law of nature. The law of nature. Hey, Crafty Lao, what's up? <laughs> but I want my living area to be here and my industry area to be here. So I need a bridge. There's, there's no going around that one. I will go bankrupt and with the bankruptancy money I will buy a sewage thing. And then people will become happy again. Oh, they're desettling. Oh god. They're like, nope. <laughs> Big no, not gonna live here. Operating at a reduced rate. All the power is still available. These people are leaving town. They're like, nope. Oh shit. This is the worst financial. I don't know. All my games start with a deficit. All my games start with a deficit. I don't know how else to do it. I don't know. It's. This is like simplest city building. Like, yeah, sure, I've got some road here that's like unnecessary, so I might delete that, you know. But this is like, this is like the simplest you can do. This is the simplest you can do. All I did was lay down some road, put down some industry, put down some housing, got some water, got some electricity going, and there you go, there's a deficit. There is just no way. <laughs> ah, this game. This game. I don't I don't I just don't understand it. Like it's this is so simple. This is like the basic of the basics. And yet people I pay through the nose to provide people the basics. It's much easier than in SimCity. Nah, it's not. It's not easier than SimCity. Because in SimCity, I never had a money problem. And here, I start with a deficit all the damn time. Oh well. We'll, uh, we'll provide sewage once the bank gives us 50k. <laughs> And then we can, you know, start building up the city as it used to be. You need shorter roads. 
Everything costs with no income, yeah. Even shorter roads. Come on, speed up. We need the uh, we need the fifty k. I don't know when it triggers, but it will trigger. Have you got road access from the other side? Nope. This is the only road access I have. Abandoned buildings. They should be demolished automatically. Oh, yeah, there they go. Because I've got the auto demolish uh, mod thingy installed. And also, I have two mods installed. Auto demolish and another one. But I can't remember the, the second one. <laughs> Everyone wants sewage. They'll just demolish the buildings and build new ones and get sewage. Come on, back rats and see. Can we go bankrupt, please? I could, I could, I'm just, I don't know. But this is definitely more difficult than SimCity. Because in SimCity, I never got bankruptancy or anything. I love that little tree here. So cute. I'll just wait and then we'll build sewage here or something because the river flows like this so we need um, or so we can build it here so people won't drink poo water and then people will be happy and move in and with that money we'll also build more of this uh, you know It's so much easier than SimCity. Well, I don't know what to say. I just never got any problems in SimCity. And in this game, I'm always in trouble. Oh, blackouts now as well. Not enough fuel, not operating. I'm assuming he'll get fuel automatically. Uh, I hope he'll get he'll get fuel automatically. <laughs> Otherwise, we have an even bigger problem. Oh boy. I mean, we could build buildings on this side. A small little suburb. Suburb. And then build some industry on this side and with the water pumps and then sewage in between. But then the suburb will get the sewage. That sucks. Does it trigger at 10k? I believe so. The smell is overwhelming. Oh, there we go, bail out. Hold it. Okay. So we'll be building some sewage on this side. So that it won't um, you know your city can't afford it probably that's probably the case so let's do some wind turbining instead 
Why not right at the end? Because that will cost more money. <laughs> That will cost more money. There we go. Have some electricity. And then we... Oh, we gotta build a... Uh, intersection, unfortunately. We just built an intersection like this. There's no way you can't build a city without intersections, I imagine. Man, it's hilly. Oh well. some commercial in the middle and you can live here if you want to that is boom here's some water and sewage there you go and boom you should be good What? Sewage is not connected? It is. It is, it is. Definitely. Yeah. Boom! Reach a population. There we go. Still in the deficit though. Uh oh. That is not good. Why are you pissed off? There you go. Be happy. Be happy people. Build buildings. Get me paying folks. Taxes. <clears throat> there we go. All right, we're almost out of the deficit. Yes. This city will be saved. <laughs> the towering industry of the future. They're still out of fuel though. Excellent. We are out of the deficit. Superb. Look at this bridge being awesome. Oh god. There's electricity problems. Get that fuel over there. We've got money. Building has run out of fuel, make sure trucks carrying it can reach the building via outside connections. They can. 
There's an outside connection here. I'm assuming that's the outside connection. I mean, I didn't make the map. <laughs> Boom! Reach a population. Excellent. We are upgrading the city. And now we're getting the very well-known garbage problem. I think they're stuck once they get into the city. What? No way. You can do, go two lanes, right? You can get out of the city. I mean, I've built everything with two lane roads, so you should be able to drive like that. Man, the electricity. Come on, trucks. Oh! Is this only one way? Oh shit. Are these highways only one way? Holy fudge crap. We need to connect them. There we go. A very temporary fast solution. Because there of course only one way for some reason. Why don't you just build two way roads? The walking man. That's that's what I call this road. Not enough electricity. Yeah, the shield truck should be on their way now. Still everyone is driving one way. Nope, nope. There we go. Look, someone's driving the other way. Away from the city. Going to ready to wear LTD. Yep. Yes, it's connected. Excellent. Superb. And they can go here and then here and then there. See? Everything's connected. This is going to be a major traffic problem. I foresee that in the future. I'm a seer. I can see that in the future. This is going to be a major traffic problem. If only we could do like a... Yeah. Like a roundabout. To go to industry, bridge, highway, or... That sort of thing. How expensive is a roundabout? Hmm. We could definitely fix that now. Let's nip this in the bud before it becomes an actual problem. Alright. Whoops. guys okay so the problem is or the problem is gonna be this part here oh this is gonna look really weird
Okay, this is going to look really weird, but it's really effective. So one highway goes there. One goes there, so it's all connected. And then you go to the... This, and then you go to the this. It looks really weird. But it's... Hey, Gizmotin! Long time no see! How are you? Oh man, this looks too weird. Oh god, there's a fire. Fire! Can we plop down a firehouse? Yes, we can. Excellent. Boom. Go do your job. It looks really weird, but I think this will solve most traffic problems um, that we're gonna have. Oh. Yeah, of course. Space already occupied? This should... There we go. And I'm sure of it. This should solve most problems that we get. <laughs> and once the fuel trucks finally get to the dam a forestry truck? What the hell? <laughs> Look at all those trucks. Yep. And then we're going to put another arm here. And that's where we plop down the garbage. Skadoosh. Have fun picking up people's garbage. There we go. Yeah. Excellent. Nipping traffic problems in the butt since 1999. <laughs> That's the un... Boom. Oh, he's already in the power grid. Excellent. Go, go, go! I can also plop down, yep. The police station. Hospital and police station. Excellent, and I can pay for it as well. Superb! This is going well. This is going well. Yes. Yes. Oh man, this bridge is going to be our new traffic problem. <laughs> this is the one connection. The one road to rule them all. One road to bind them. Or something. I don't know really. One road to rule them all. One road to find them. One road to bring them all in darkness, bind them. I think that was the first, but... That's going to be our next major traffic problem. I can just sense it already. And since we're garbaging anyway, in this area, we're turning this into like a... Like a garbage road thingy anyway we might as well just plop down some industry because this place is gonna be garbage anyway <gasps> G 
Jinana76, welcome to the Prophets and thank you so much for the follow! Thank you as well to uh, to test the new following alert. As you guys may have noticed, the sound is actually working again. This morning I uh, rummaged around with the follow alert and um, yeah, it works once again. Excellent. So put down, putting down a second garbage thingy, thingamajig. Get more garbage trucks in there. Oh, followers, get, yeah, it sounds loud, but I didn't know. Like I said, I was working on it this morning, so all of a sudden it's like, oh my god, like, poof, here's a follow. <laughs> Oh shit, it's loud, but it works. It works. I'm, I'm glad the sound works Because I was feeling so sad that I was missing follows Because I didn't have my follower sound anymore. Turns out that my dev the uh, follow alert thing that I use has been completely rem remodeled revised and everything So that's probably why the si sound didn't work Meh. It's now fixed that's the good part. All right, let us teach our children. There we go. Let us teach our children. Ooh, there are only 28 students eligible in the city. Hmm, that's new. Means we need more students. Where are the garbage trucks? Here they are. They're picking up this trash, right? Oh man, they're already full. Damn. There we go. <laughs> New services. Ooh. Not really for a city this size, I'd imagine. Let's let's save and Profitville. Look at all my attempts on cities. Interesting roundabout, yeah. I I think it solves the uh, the problems really well. Just about to like like nip it in the butt, you know, the uh, the traffic problems before they arise. <clears throat> um, because my previous cities before they oh before they had a roundabout it uh it was really crap but this is going to be my next next biggest issue man i, I can i can sense it i can feel it this bridge is gonna be blah Gonna, the city's gonna expand and then the traffic's gonna pile up and then you know oops a burned down building it does look like the, the dancing spider that's actually a great name for a roundabout disconnect the power grids where oh what's that what what needs power Oh, I saw. Oh God! Oh God! The zone got my. Uh, oh, I see. Wait, it's way easier if we just do this. Boom. All right, so. Oh man, the fire. Fire! Buy new land? Why would I buy new land? I haven't even properly started on this one yet. Oh, this is gonna be Sewage Bridge Inc. Oh well. Why aren't I doing anything to stop the fires? Get a fire station right here. 
gotta pass across the bridge though, which is next problem in waiting. All right, let's expand this city because the problem seemed to be, you know, managed. I'm just tempted to build a second bridge. None. Oh, right. Not enough money. Low happiness. Oh, we've got plus ninety nine. What are you talking about? Low happiness. The Rouge deck. Oh, not enough money. Here comes the not enough money part. Assuming this side could be as well. And then we're plopping down some commercial. No, not here, not here. There, yeah, yeah, that's fine. Some here. Yeah, that's fine. And then some services here if required. Let's try and water these guys. All right. The plus. Next to this mighty face is the amount of people entering the city, not the happiness. Oh, really? I did not know. <laughs> I, thought, I thought that was the happiness. But the happiness is green, right? So that's good. Global happiness, green. Global happiness even. Not just on my city, but of the entire globe. People are happy. Our town is becoming a real city. Chirper. Greenlight City Limit Expansion. Huh. So 88 people are moving into the city on a weekly basis. That is good to know. This bridge is gonna be taxed to its limit. I should really upgrade this bridge. To medium roads, large roads, to highways, maybe. Just because I foresee a shitload of traffic coming through here. I mean, it's not expensive now anymore, so. Boom. There we go. Zoom across the bridge. Look at the new unlocked services. Oh right, trees and stuff. Let's plop down Paradox Plaza. Creators of this game and other great Amazing games, well, not creators, but distributors of other great amazing games, such as Mountain Blade. Hey, Binary, what's up, man? How you doing? Fire! Oh, the fire department's already here. Trying to save it. 
Zoom, zoom, zoom. This highway. People can just cross this bridge in style. Right, um... Oh! There are enough students in the city. And not even everything is... lived on. What? Why is there so low demand? What's the... what's the reason? Oh, they need better... So, oh, hey! They need a, somewhere where they... Uh, where they can put their dead. Bring out your dead and all that good stuff. Let's uh let's educate some people. Skadoosh. And let's uh let's allow them to uh bring out their dead. Skadoosh. Get all the services you require. Cool, right? Living next to a cemetery. Oh, they like it. Wow. A Burger King joint. <laughs> Man, this roundabout is, was a good idea. This roundabout was a good idea. Alright, people are moving in. Citizens are happy. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we take our very first break of the day. Every hour on Astro Games Days, I take a small break. Three to four minutes. To allow you guys the opportunity to um, go to the bathroom, take a drink, stretch your legs, do what it is, whatever you need to do. And I'll be back in three to four minutes with uh, more City Skylines. We're going to see how we can expand this quickly, positively city, this quickly becoming positive city, uh, to more limits and beyond. So we've got a whole buildable area right here that we can turn into something magnificent. So uh, yeah, <laughs> industry lane here. We'll see what we can do when I come back after this small break. See you guys in a bit.